A woman who was born in the U.S. and left the country to fight for ISIS is tonight begging to come back home. Correspondent Benjamin Hall recently spoke with Hoda Muthana, who is now in a refugee camp in northern Syria. In the dying days of the caliphate, thousands of ISIS families fled into the Syrian desert, trying to escape. Among them, Hoda Muthana, the woman born in America who joined ISIS and now regrets it. I just want to go back home. <laughs> To see my family. I want him to be safe. But the U.S. says Muthana is not and has never been a U.S. citizen because her father was a Yemeni diplomat at the time of her birth. Muthana lived in Hoover, Alabama, and claims she was radicalized online. In 2014, ISIS was ascendant, committing horrible atrocities, and 19 year old Muthana left the U.S. to join them. You turn your back on America. You've got to do better than that. You've got to, you've got to explain why you made this decision. But she couldn't, except no comment, and always that laughter and a denial she hated America. I didn't hate America. I didn't hate anything. I just thought it was a, a victory for me. I would, me, when I started practicing, I was very scared of the concept of hellfire. She married three ISIS fighters, had a child, and became a mouthpiece for the terror group. Go on drive-bys and spill all their blood, she tweeted, or rent a big truck and drive all over them. Kill them. She claims ISIS took over her Twitter account and that now, with therapy, she could become a model citizen. Before I came, I've never done any crime, and I'm sure I'm not going to be doing any crimes in the future. And I know I've come to Syria and look like I supported, like, basically the worst terror group in probably history. Muthana denies that she only fled the caliphate because it fell, but her tweets and the timeline suggest otherwise. And in the eyes of the State Department, she's nothing more than a terrorist. Brett? Benjamin, thank you.